Hi, welcome to the Summer Rain Channel. Today we're going to make a kelp and green tea face mask. It is packed with nutrients and vitamins and um, different ingredients that are very soothing for our skin. If you haven't done so already, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below. I do post a new video every week. I also post a link to my blog where you can get the full recipe. Without further ado, let's go ahead and learn how to make this face mask. For the first phase, we have two ingredients. We have powdered aloe vera, which is just aloe in powdered form. It is very soothing and cooling and amazing for your skin, especially in the summer. And then we have vegetable glycerin, which is used for its moisturizing properties. So to start, we just wanna go ahead and disperse the aloe into the vegetable glycerin. And then give it a good mix. And we go ahead and we disperse it like this just to make sure it mixes in all the way. In this phase, we have green tea, which is very moisturizing and it's filled with antioxidants. Then we have kelp powder. So kelp is actually from the sea, it's a plant, and it is packed with nutrients that your skin loves. And then we have chamomile powder, which is very soothing for your skin. Again, I really wanted to go with a nice soothing um, moisturizing face mask. And then what we'll do is we'll go ahead, we'll put all of our ingredients into a mixing bowl. So we have our green tea, our kelp, and our chamomile. And to that, we're just gonna go ahead and add our vegetable glycerin and aloe. And we'll go ahead and add our water. And you're gonna to wanna to mix this up very well. And it's still a little bit thick, so I'm gonna add just a little bit more water and then mix that in. And I think that's a good consistency, so we'll go ahead, we will add our tea tree oil. Mix that in. And there is your face mask. You're gonna to wanna to take note that this doesn't contain a preservative, so it's not something that you can make and then just leave it for a few days or anything like that. It's something that you wanna make as you're gonna use it. If you wanted to extend the shelf life just a little bit, you could mix all the powder stuff together and just add the wet ingredients when you are ready to use it. So completely up to you how you wanna do that. I hope you enjoy the video and I hope you enjoy the face mask.